Yeah, so there, there are a number of states this year that we're identifying as Latino influence states, states where uh, the Latino vote, whether it's high in numbers or whether it breaks really strongly towards uh, one party or the other, uh, will tip the outcome, will influence the election um, in the presidential election as well as in the elections for U.S. Senate. So those states that are high influence states for Latinos are states like Nevada, Colorado, and Florida. Those are the really big three that have the most influence. After that, uh, we look at states like North Carolina and Virginia. These are states that have had huge increases in the Latino voting population and are really, really close, really tight. Uh, and then there's states like Iowa, uh, which are also really close right now and used to have very small Latino population. We saw huge growth to places like Iowa over the years. Now those people are becoming citizens or their children who are turning 18. And the Latino population, even in Iowa, the voting population, uh, could have a huge influence this year. Uh, then you have another state, the state of Arizona, where that's a state that has traditionally voted Republican uh, for the last few election cycles and doesn't seem like it would, would be very competitive. But it's getting closer and it's getting closer entirely because of the Latino vote. It's about 20%, one out of five voters in Arizona is a Latino. And if those numbers are increased, if they're even higher than we expect in 2012, Arizona could be a state that actually is won by the Democratic Party, it would be entirely because of the Latino vote. And in Arizona, we're finding some of the highest Democratic vote numbers uh, among Latinos of any state in the country. And that's almost entirely driven by the very negatively perceived SB 1070, the bill uh, that was signed by uh, Republican Governor Jan Brewer and was recently decided by the U.S. Supreme Court. This is something that has turned Latinos off from the Republican Party in Arizona uh, in droves. And so if Arizona is one of those surprise states this year, 2012, it will be because um, of Latino participation. Do you think that